Hi everybody. Uh, I just wanted to let you know about this new deck I bought. It's called Zodiac Oracle by Barberi. I hope that's how you pronounce his name. Or that name. Is it Barberi or Barbieri? I think it's Barberi. Uh, it's Barbara Moore. Did the artwork? Oh no, this is by Barbara Moore and the artwork is by Pilo Barberi. So Barbieri is the uh, artist. Isn't that gorgeous? The box is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I bought these. Where did I get these? Ugh, Amazon.ca. I think, uh, how much did I pay for these? I think I paid something like $26. I took the cards out, but there's a ribbon here that helped me pull the cards out, which is really cool. Really cool. Very nice, nice box. It comes with a beautiful uh, guidance book. See that? Oh, my camera is not focusing properly. There we go. Very, very good. It has full explanation of all these cards. There's three sets. This is an Oracle deck, so there's three different sets in this uh, deck. So, first of all, I'm going to leave this open. Let me think. Okay. So, there's this different signs. There's the fire sign, air sign, water sign, and earth. So there's the four different elements. And uh, it tells you that uh, the element, the fire element, isn't that beautiful? Look at that, eh? Absolutely gorgeous. This element is Aries. Leo, isn't that gorgeous, eh? Sagittarius. So these three signs, the element is fire. Then there's the water sign. That's beautiful, isn't it? Very beautiful artwork. So the water, the three um, zodiacs for the water is Cancer, Scorpio, isn't that beautiful, and Pisces, absolutely gorgeous. That is the water sign, the air, this is the air sign, the element. Focus, focus. Okay, so this is air. And the, uh, the zodiac signs are Gemini, hmm, why? I don't know why my camera's not focusing. So it's Gemini, this is Libra, that's beautiful, very beautiful, and Aquarius, that's gorgeous, isn't it? These are the three air signs, and then the, next, the last element is Earth. Come on, focus, camera, focus. What the heck is going on with it? Oh, there we go, it's getting there. Anyhow, that's Earth. And the zodiac signs are Taurus. There we go, there we go, focus. So that's Taurus. Virgo, isn't she beautiful, eh? These are earth signs. Capricorn, gorgeous. And that was all from <clears throat> the earth sign, the earth element. Okay, 
And also, and th also there are the cards of uh, every planet. All the planets are here. So this is, focus please. So that's the moon. Come on, focus my darling. Okay, so that's the moon. And then there's Mercury. Isn't that beautiful? The sun, that is absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Neptune. Uranus. Saturn. That's beautiful, isn't it? Jupiter. There we go. Now it's focusing. Oh, this camera. So that's Jupiter. Mars. Oh, that's gorgeous. Venus. And Pluto. And in the book, it has meanings for every card. <clears throat> There's a different meaning for every uh, planet. And uh, this book is excellent, excellent. It talks about, it, it really describes all the uh, zodiac signs all the um, element signs and all the meanings for every planet and uh, here's a good example so the elements are uh, so fire I'll just read this to you fire is uh, powerful focused and intense the energy of fire burns brightly and moves quickly passion drive the desire passion drive the desire to create strong and sometimes scary emotions like anger are fueled by fire Water is flowing, cleansing, and healing. The energy of water refreshes and moves gently. Uh, spiritual renewal, forgiveness, and the need to connect, to understand, and, under, and be understood. Intimacy and creative expression ride the current of water. Woohoo! Air is crisp, ethereal, and decisive. The energy of air fuels the winds of truth and whispers grand insights. Clarity and truth are supported by rationality, reason, common sense, and logic. Air energy breaks stalemates and stagnation through wise decision making and mutual understanding. Isn't that great? And earth is stable, secure, and abundant. The energy of earth nurtures life and promotes long leisurely pleasures, the things we need, the things we want, and the material and temporal things we value are expressed here. So this book really goes into great detail about exactly how to read these cards. So what you're gonna do is um, you would like shuffle them. I had to read this book. <clears throat> I have to read it again and again <laughs> to get this clear. So you would uh, divide the three cars so you know the elements in one section uh, zodiac signs in another pile and the moon the uh, planets in another pile and then each section you would just shuffle while you're asking the question and uh, one card would fall out or you pull out one card and then you do the same thing with the zodiac signs even though you'll pull a zodiac sign that you are not the zodiac sign of this book uh, describes exactly what uh, the meaning of that zodiac sign is and it kind of gives you a little bit of an answer to your question and the same thing with the planets they each have a meaning and uh, I just find this very very interesting very interesting I really have to learn how to use this I just love this isn't that gorgeous Barbary zodiac Oracle absolutely gorgeous I hope you enjoyed this. You have yourself a great day.